the 2K Sports pregame show presented by Kia. And welcome to the NBA Conference Finals on 2K Sports. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny Smith. Game one is upon us, and this looks like it will be a fantastic series. For tonight's game, we'll be watching the Golden State Warriors as they go up against the Timberwolves in Minneapolis. For the Timberwolves, they've appeared to be invincible thus far in the playoffs, having yet to lose a single game. We'll see if they can continue that winning streak tonight. And now we have the conference finals. Four teams left competing for a chance to face off for the championship. Shaq, you've been in a few of these bad boys. Tell yeah, us what it's like. Yeah, every team left at this point is a legit contender. As a star player, this is when you want to take over the game and be a leader and get your followers up on Instagram. Yeah. Oh, no oh question. that's very important. Or Facebook very or Twitter. Important. Yeah, no question. If you don't get those up, you're going to be in trouble. Because yeah. this is really when you want your bigs to assert themselves. You know, you want them to have SLN. You know what that is? Shaq, Shaq like numbers. numbers. Oh, no question. You know, yeah. 4,388 times he's talked about it. So. Yeah. But uh, I played with one of the best guys ever, I think, Hakeem Olajuwon. You know, his ability to make people better around him as well as be a dominant force was second to none. This is when your bigs assert themselves. You know who's got a, you know who's got a lot of followers? Who? Who's that? Kevin Harlan. Really? There's like 12 followers. Kenny, did Here's you Kevin. say I played? Yes. Oh, Add that oh, to the list. Another tally for the Jets. Game time, friends. I hope you guys been practicing. Are you kidding me, man? Stay ready so you ain't got to get ready. I hate I have to be the ones that knock you guys out. But somebody's got to do it. Okay. Well, we'll see. Just trust me, I have no intention of starting my summer vacation early. May the best man win, man. May the best man win. And it's going to be me. We've got a capacity crowd in a sold-out arena here in downtown Minneapolis. Two Western teams have run the gauntlet. Only one can emerge victorious to claim a spot in the finals. Game one of the Western Conference Finals begins in a moment. Alongside Chris Weber and Greg Anthony, I'm Kevin Harlan, the fourth member of our crew. From the sideline, Hall of Famer David Aldridge. Taking a look at Minnesota. In a seven-game series, they have the home crowd advantage. You can you can feel it in the air, guys. But will they be able to start this series with the win? And they're ready to go. I mean, as we can hear, so are their fans. This can be an intimidating building to play in when the crowd is discharged up. That alone gives them a huge leg up. And with pregame routines coming to an end, we're just about ready for our tip-off. First, though, let's get a report from the sideline and say hello to David Aldridge. Well, Kevin Durant is back after missing most of 2015 after requiring a third surgery to repair a bone in his foot. He said it was the first time I had to face something being snatched away from me that I loved so much. I just tried to stay positive and feel that if I put the same work ethic in, then things will turn out all right for me. Kevin? Great to have him healthy and back out on the floor, DA. Thank you. Off goes to Minnesota. And so game one of the Western Conference Final is now underway. And now the Golden State Warriors starters. He has the Splash Brothers in the backcourt. Green is out there with Petrulia. And it's Durant in at the small forward spot. And Thompson throws it down. Oh, you know, an underrated part of Thompson's game, the ability to dominate the cup. And Young kicks to Towns. Young dishes to Lewis. No good on the shot. The Warriors go the other way with it. Durant the pass to Kerr. A shot by Thompson and no one's around. And a great assist by Curry as that one goes in. And it looks like he might just be on his A game today, Clark. It's early, but he's off to a terrific start. It'll be interesting to see if he can keep his foot on the pedal. Now here's Lewis. 
Young for three. And it's Durant with the rebound. And stolen by Wiggins. Drops in the breakaway layup. Curry with it. They double team Curry. Thompson from long range. Andrew Wiggins grabs the board. The Timberwolves have gone two for four from the field so far today. Towns pitch to Wiggins at the top of the key, Lewis. Good D by Thompson. That's just an outstanding job by the D there to get in his way without fouling and changing the direction of that shot. Out of bounds, Minnesota takes possession. What an awful decision there. No reason that turnover should have taken place. On defense, the Warriors. Higgins outside. Lewis on the way. And that one goes in as he is fouled. It'll be three points if he converts at the line. <laughs> really, Prez is out of this world. His ability to knock down these tough shots despite the contact, that's what makes him so special. They double-team Curry. And Thompson kicks to Durant. And Count the basket is fouled, and he's going to the line for one more. Oh, that's just great offensive skill. Consistently helping his teammates generate points. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. That free throw good from Durant. Oh, man, and the little shoulder shrug at the line. Keeping that shooting arm loose. Durant's game is so fluid. So fluid. You see why he's been compared to the Iceman, George Gurley. And finish off by friends. Okay, two hands for safety. That's, that's what they say, right? Uh, that's right. He was ultra safe with that dunk. No question. Here in the first, just under two and a half minutes played so far. Lewis against Thompson. He feeds it to Curry. It's tipped. Here's Lewis. Prez finishing off the play with the dunk. He won't miss many of those. Hey, you can just see him psyching himself up after a play like that. Nice slam by Prez. I mean, you have to love the awareness of Curry's sick look to find an open team. And Young kicks to Towns. Dishes to Wiggins. Passes it to Young. And Young just drilling the three there. Nice look. Can this be and that's the shot ocean. that's dropping for Young when he is playing with confidence. Thompson for three. Again, the miss by Thompson. Timberwolves leading by five. Wiggins kicks to Towns. Lewis attacking. Green with the block. And good anticipation by Draymond. I mean, he always gets in position for these clean swats like this one. So it's Minnesota now. We've got 113 left in the first quarter. Wiggins dishes to Lewis. So he gets the whistle. Contact on the way up and two shots coming up. He made the only free throw attempt he had earlier in the game. And the first one at the line is good. And really, Perez is a fantastic player, a true leader on the floor who his teammates look up to. Looking at who's out there now for the Timberwolves. Jang, he's checked in for Carl Anthony Towns. Hill comes in for Nicholson. And Levine subbed in for Wiggins. Different look here for the Warriors. West is checked in for Pachulia. Kavon Looney comes in for Green. Andre Iguodala is checked in for Kevin Durant. And it's Livingston in for Clay Thompson. He's not very smooth down in the low post, but still, he should make those shots regardless. No one near Iguodala as he lets it go. And it's Iguodala again missing. Lewis down low. He's covered by Iguodala. Four seconds separating the shot and game clocks. And the call will be against Come on. That's his first foul. Shabazz Muhammad's checked in for Minnesota. Dunn comes in for Young. Warriors trail by five. 
Lewis in at shooting guard. Towns is out there with Andrew Nicholson. And it's Young. And it's Wiggins in at the three. So that's the lineup for Minnesota. Uh, the defense took a big risk leaving him wide open and got lucky. He clinked that outside shot. Lewis against Thompson. And fouled hard that time. He'll get to the line and shoot two. That one on Thompson. Perez is totally committed inside. A wrecking ball who wreaks havoc in the post. He is three for three from the free throw line. Good on the second free throw. Now here's Livingston. Now let's go to the sideline and catch up with our Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. Well, Perez in their last game against the Clippers was phenomenal. He finished with 36 points and also was a pest on defense with a lot of steals. He put up numbers that really jumped out in the box score. A very solid performance. Kevin, we'll see what he's got in his arsenal tonight. David, thanks for the great update and what a jaw-dropping performance that was, guys. I couldn't believe what I was seeing. I mean, he's given himself a hard act to follow here tonight. Yeah, and I, and I think that's the point of it, but I think he likes that. It's a challenge to try to improve upon what was such a spectacular display last time out. No good off the front iron. And that's a well-contested shot. Solid defense. They weren't going anywhere against them there. Livingston passes to Thompson. Good on the shot. Thompson's got 10 points in the game. Oh, just the way Clay catches the ball. If he's already in the shooting motion, you're in trouble. Thompson against Lewis. Takes it off the glass. Lewis has got the lead up to six now for the Timberwolves. The Warriors have gone four of six in the field here in the second. Livingston kicks to Pachulia. Pass to Livingston. And the pass to Pachulia. Durant dishes to Livingston. Four on the shot clock. Pachulia, no luck. Minnesota leading by six. Wiggins passes to Lewis. From 12 feet out. And the Timberwolves tack on two more. You have to love the penetration from Perez. Just absolutely fearless in how he exploits the defense. And Lewis comes to help. Durant for three. A rebound by Young. And even with good coverage defensively that time, he has confidence to drill the three. Lewis, a chance to extend the lead to double digits, but it's no good. And Thompson kicks to Livingston. To the middle. Golden State moving the ball around. Green dishes to Livingston. Shoots. And Carl Anthony Towns pulls it down. The defense got super lucky there because he does not miss many of those. Towns the screen. And it's good once more. Nice make there from Lewis. And now a 10-point Timberwolves lead. Golden State's gone 0-3 from beyond the arc to start the second quarter. And the call will I'm be against Perez. That That's steal. foul number two for him. Presidential Park. Not good. He already has two early fouls here, and he has to watch himself for the rest of the half. Nikola Pekovic is checked in for the Timberwolves. And the Warriors also making a change. Curry's checked in. Now here's Thompson. Ten points for him. Three-pointer. That's a miss, and with it, he is five for nine. Clearly a two-for-one situation here, guys. In situations like this, they don't necessarily have to rush the shot, but they should try to get a fast, easy look at the basket here. Lewis misses. Uh, the lane was relatively open and didn't take advantage of a golden opportunity. Thompson passes to Durant. He just recorded his third foul and a half. Coach has to consider resting him to the third quarter. The Warriors shooting their second and third shots at the line right here. That free throw good from Thompson. And that does it for the first half of play. Timberwolves lead by seven. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks, Kevin. Alongside Steve Kerr and Coach, what is the offensive approach going to be in the second half? 
Well, we just have to do what we do, move the ball um, and wear them down with our ball movement, our cutting and our spacing and set better screens, all the, all the usual stuff. Yeah, it always seems to work out for you in the long run. Thanks, Steve. Back to you, Kevin. Thanks so much, Dave, for the great interview. Don't go away, folks. We'll be back for the second half of basketball right after this. Bring it in. We have not won this game yet. Simple question, guys. Do you want to stop Curry? Answer me. Do you want to stop him? Because it doesn't look like you do. He's carving us up when he's using those screens. I want to show hard on the pick and roll. Do not let him turn the corner on those screens. Let's do this, gentlemen. Let's get this W. The buildings of downtown Minneapolis all lit up on this lovely evening. Welcome back, everyone, to the Twin Cities. And we welcome you back to our presentation of Game 1. We're seeing a tremendous game from Preds. Well, anytime you can get to the free throw line with that kind of consistency, that just makes every other facet of the game easy. Uh, slashing hard to the bucket in the first half, almost looking to draw contact. You love that kind of fearless play. And Golden State looking at who they got. The incredible shooting pair of Curry and Thompson in the backcourt. Durant is out there with Green, and it's Pachulia in at the center, locking down the middle. And he gets it to go as they call the foul. He's on his way to the line for one more. Man, have they been effective at getting the ball inside. The Timberwolves have only one missed free throw. They've had five attempts and made four of them. Warriors trail by 10. They double team Curry. Green kicks to Curry. The screen from Thompson. On deep. Curry shot is off. A slight rebound advantage for them. One more column in their favor, and it's all adding up. On the wing, Wiggins. To the paint. And finish off by Prez. And I love the shot selection by Prez. Playing well within the offense there and burying a lot of buckets in the process. Now here's Thompson. 13 points in the game. Good on the bucket. I mean, he was great in his last game. Clearly, he has not lost that love and feel. Not at all. You can tell his confidence is really soaring as a result. He wants the ball in his hands any chance he can get it. They are up in this game right now, and he is one of the reasons why, given his stellar shooting from the field. He dishes it to Green. Ball's knocked loose. Stolen by Lewis. With a floater, and scoring with the play inside is Young. Young's got his second basket of the night. Warriors trail by 14. Curry dishes to Thompson. They get a hand on it, and Prez with a clear path to the hoop. And finish off by Prez. And Prez is an active player, clogging up passing lanes with his quickness. And his defensive instincts remarkable. Curry passes to Thompson. There's the dish to Pachulia. Kicks it to Durant. And stolen by Wiggins. And it's Towns penetrating. That balls. Nice feed that time from Wiggins. Wiggins has got his third assist on the night. Thompson outside. They need this. Shot number 12 goes in. He's made 7 of 12 now. And he's really shot the ball well, but, but it hasn't been contagious. And Young kicks to Lewis. Young outside. Lewis on the way. He's covered by Thompson. Bangs home the trifecta. Eight points for Justice Young. And really, Young is never going to pass up a catch-and-shoot opportunity. He's remarkably efficient with those kinds of shots. Now, here's Curry. Open shot, Thompson. Lewis grabs the board. Solid rebound there, and with the score like it is, that's an area where they can't afford to get lazy. And foul called as he misses. He'll go to the line and shoot two.
He's had five chances at the line, gone four for five. Mr. President, two shots. The free throw drops for Lewis. And some changes here for the Timberwolves. Porky Dangs checked in for Carl Anthony Towns. Hill comes in for Nicholson. And Levine subbed in for Andrew Wiggins. Different look here for the Warriors. David West, he's checked in for Pachulia. Kavon Looney comes in for Draymond Green. Andre Igudawa is checked in for Kevin Durant. And it's Livingston in for Thompson. Now here's Lewis following the miss by David West. The kick out to Young. Hits the three-point bomb. Young's got eight points in the quarter. How about the passing? They are moving the ball without any thought, without any individual agenda. Clearly, he's not pleased with all. Hey, this is what happens when we play our brand of basketball. They cannot stop us. Just keep squeezing that orange juice, gentlemen. Minnesota making some changes. Warriors trail by 20, all fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset the lineups courtesy of Gatorade for the fourth quarter. So on the floor for Minnesota, Lewis in its small forward. Young is out there with Levine. Then there's Towns, and it's Jang in at the four. With the hook shot, and he sinks that one in the back of the rim on the box. way in. 27 points for Prez. Here's Durant. And a great assist by Curry as that one goes in. Curry's got his fifth assist in this one. And Young kicks to Lewis. Durant with the steal. And up the court come the Warriors on the break. Durant's got the ball. And it's going to be two free throws. Drew contact on the shot. Oh, such smooth footwork. The understanding of the game. Iguodala drawing the foul in close. Minnesota making some changes. Andrew Nicholson comes in for Jang. And Andrew Wiggins is up in for Zach Levine. Now, here is Young. Now, Lewis fires from the line. That shot misses. Good D by Thompson. Green dishes to Curry. Thompson for three. That's a basket. Is eighth from the field, eight of 14. You can tell he's getting a feel for his shot in the second half. Young passes to Lewis. First minute and a half of basketball played here in the fourth quarter. They're doing a really good job of getting the ball inside and attacking the paint. That's an area they have completely dominated. Pachulia, he's checked in for Golden State. Warriors trail by 15. Curry with it. Now guarded by Prez. Pachulia kicks to Green. Golden State moving the ball around. Curry dishes to Durant. And a miss there on the triple. The Timberwolves have gone two or three from the field to get the fourth quarter start. Here's Lewis. Good D by Thompson. That's the kind of shot you want him to take every time. He just happened to miss that time. And now, running up the court, Lewis pushing it up. Warriors with the rebound. And the call will be against Prez. That will get him his fourth foul of the game. When you get tagged with your fourth foul, you have to be very careful the rest of the way. Thompson outside. Let's the three fly. And again, no good by Golden State. And on an open look like that, he's very gifted at making the weak coverage pay. Lewis down low. It's up against Thompson. Lewis gets the bucket. Oh, this has been an amazing display, a true crowd-pleasing performance for him. I mean, and it's helped get this team the lead. Here's Green. It's deflected, and that'll be Golden State as it goes out of bounds. Warriors retain possession. For those just joining us, fourth quarter here, we're just over two and a half minutes into it. That one goes in. Uh, and, and for a guy who puts up huge scoring numbers almost on a nightly basis, plays on another planet right now. And Young kicks to Lewis. 
He can't hit that time. And Golden State will come the other way. And the call will be against Prez. That will be foul number five on him. Yeah, clearly he had an established position there. We're in the final quarter of play here, three minutes Time in. Out. Time out. Start it. Way to work, gentlemen. Let's go now. Hustle up. An alarming rate. And I'm sure that's what they're discussing right now. Those turnovers. They have to take care of the basketball. Value each possession. And we've got an update here, so let's catch up with David Aldridge. Hey guys, I was able to catch the message Steve Kerr gave to his team. He told them flat out, we are turning the ball over too much, guys. We can't keep making the hero ball play. Slow it down, run the offense, and make the safe pass. Back to you, Kevin. Timberwolves leading by 13. 149 left in the fourth quarter of this one. The shot misses. Good D by Thompson. Warriors have gone five of eight shooting as we've come down the home stretch in this final quarter. That's good, and a nice assist from Durant. Thompson's got a pair of threes here in the fourth quarter for the Warriors. And here's Young. And there's the call on Clay Thompson. That's his fifth foul. A little over three and a half minutes in the books so far here in the fourth. Lewis attacking. Uh, entering the league as a pure score. Thompson has developed into one of the league's better defenders as well. Tires from deep. Carl Anthony Towns with the rebound. The Timberwolves have gotten only three of their nine field goal attempts to go down since the end of the third. Pretty cold down the stretch. Man, if ever there were a way to kick off the NBA Conference Finals, this is it. Going to be a table-setting victory here in Game 1 for Minnesota. They never settled for mediocre shots. And, Kevin, they had great penetration this time out. A fantastic show. And, and what an amazing all-around game it was for Prez. You have to focus on the steals he came up with. They were huge factors in the end result. And a missed lane. You can see he just rushed that a little bit. Lost the focus, I think. No one near Curry as he lets it go. No good on the three. Five-second differential between the shot clock and the game clock. Lewis against Thompson. Trying to get back on track. And it's laid in by Prez. Nice job, Orange Juice. Hustle up. Take a seat. Well, look, you always want to give your all for your home crowd. It's so... so it's Minnesota winning this one easy. A pretty good feeling right now for them to be out in front like this in the series. You know, Kevin, momentum so, so critical. And you know they'll want to ride this wave into game two. That concludes this broadcast of the Western Conference Finals. For David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, and Chris Weber, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for watching the NBA on 2K Sports. We'll see you later. What's up, Steve? What's going on, Prez? Guys back in the studio want to talk to you. Perfect. The 2K Sports Post Game Show. Thank you so much, Kevin. And with this one in the books, we're ready to present our Jordan player of the game, Prez. This is Shaq. Uh, first off, congratulations on the win. What do you think was the key factor in putting this game away? What? Come on, Shaq. The key factor was that we were just better than them, man. I have no problem being blunt about it because it isn't news to them either, man. We just wiped the floor with them tonight, bro. I'm surprised we didn't win by 20 or more. I guess we got to save something for the next meeting, though, huh? If I look up cocky in the dictionary, I'm sure I'm going to see a picture of your face. Great job, buddy. I'm so jealous of you. I would have got fined for saying that.
And thanks for watching tonight's coverage of the NBA Conference Finals, and there's more coming your way. For Shaq, for Kenny, Ernie Johnson. See you later, everybody.